because uh, he does not rock. I need fingernail clippers. Get as close to the mic as you can. We're going to get famous now. Hi, hey, Manang. Okay, just so you guys know, Annie and I are kind of cringe-worthy at the very beginning of our podcast. Yes. But, well, so, it's kind of charming, though. I yeah, think. it's really cute. Is that honestly. the charm? Can we just look like... <laughs> The whole time. <laughs> no, no, no. So how we so always start our uh, podcast is with a song. <laughs> so do you guys have any song requests that we could sing? Or about? song suggestions, like mm-hmm. parodies. Um, we will incorporate the words full send into the set yeah. song. Uh, the eBay song by Weird Al. Yeah. I don't know the eBay um, song. What? It, it's to the tune of sing I it. Want It That Way by the Backstreet Boys. So I want it that way. We I wanna full sing. That's it. That's it. That's Tell it. Okay, okay uh, ready? Everyone, yeah, everyone has to sing too. So all right, let's do it. Okay, Wait, what is it again? I want a full sing. I want a full sing. Is that supposed to be going? Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> yes. All right. He's ready? the musical one of the group. Yeah. Hey, yeah Andrew, count us <laughs> off. Ready? Yeah, can you? Four, five, so six. Uh, yeah, that's do the, good. You, oh no, you gotta do it. Uh, Three, two, one. I want a full set. I can't handle Tell this at all. Why? Okay, that was enough. All right, that that's fine. Nice. We were starting a band. Okay. Uh, I was actually starting a band. We we all Hello. Welcome. Oh, welcome to the Full Send Friday podcast. Slash Matt and Andy's Caffeine oh, yeah. Corner. <laughs> <laughs> like, what up? Yeah, you like, have to like look here. good. No, it's good. <laughs> we're collaborating we're today. Yeah. Yes. Wait. This is for our podcast. Yeah, this is for our podcast. I'm Annie. And I'm Emily. And we're your masters, masters of send. Oh. I really hate that we wow, say that's that. So, I don't hate so now it. you guys can do your introduction. I'm not going to lie. We don't do anything that cool. Well, introduce slash, yourselves. Uh, so morning. this is... Uh, yeah, good morning. <laughs> good morning. <laughs> Usually we have coffee. Uh, but it's like late now. Oh, yeah, we don't, don't have coffee. Yeah, it's I had okay. Uh, Top of the morning. Uh, yes. Can uh, you say your names? Yes, this is uh, Matthew slash Matt slash Maddie Ice slash Matthew Ice. Whoa. I mean, yeah, Matthew Ice is when he needs <laughs> yeah. to be And formal. Andrew. And okay. Andy Vogues. So can you guys please tell me where you guys are from, what your majors are, and why you chose that field of study? Yeah, you go first because you're interesting. Mm, uh, okay. <laughs> uh, where am I from? I'm from the Chicago suburbs. Not to be mistaken with Chicago itself, as most people say. <laughs> yeah, most people then, suck. Wait, so you're from Chicago? <laughs> yes. Uh, and then, what was the other question? What, what are you studying? What do I study? And why? I study computer engineering because I thought it sounded cool. And Genuinely? Well, kind of, actually. It was like, well, I don't know what I like. And I tried this programming thing once, and it was pretty fun. And I want to know how a computer works. Are you, like, actually, like, savvy? Savvy? Savvy like, like savvy. Jack Sparrow? Yeah. yeah. Savvy. I didn't make it this far without becoming somewhat tech savvy. <laughs> are you, are you a are you like Mac good? or a PC person? But he person. can fix the Xbox when it freezes. So oh, like nice. you're a what? Linux. What's uh, that? It's the better operating L-E-N-N-O-X. system. L i n n o x. L i n u x. Oh, just kidding. Huh. So confused. That's wild. <laughs> so there's like you can have like Apple, you could have Windows, or you could have Linux, and Linux for at least computer geeks is like the best. What's something what? that everyone who is just like a normal person like me shouldn't like what's just like your advice like just like, like if you could tell anyone <laughs> anything technology really, come on you have to help come me on. out a little bit um, Sorry. she's pr- she's pretty tech unsavvy <laughs> yeah <laughs> if you're so many people go with iPhones and it angers me but it's only because they want something simple and I wish Don't more people yes, would that's try why we I do it I wish <laughs> people would branch out and try something more complicated but why? Why, yeah. why is simple not better? Or because not okay? If the world why is, make your life easy world when it could be simple. complicated? The world isn't simple. Why should we don't? I mean, if you don't. That's why care you want enough. a simple phone because the world's complicated enough. No, 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 no. You're, we're never <laughs> gonna agree. Yeah. Understand <laughs> this how it complicated a computer, like a computer, is? Like, why would you settle for something simple? Do you have an iPhone? You're, no. What do you what? have? I have an Android. Okay. So Matt. Where are you from? What are you studying? Why are you studying it? Yes. Uh, so my name is Matthew. Uh, What's your middle name? James. That's such a classic I was evangelical gonna guess middle that. name. Matthew James. Matthew James. James. Oh, it's it your flows. Instagram name. It is, yes. Oh, well, maybe oh. that's why. Let's, like, plug it. <laughs> at um, Matthew. At Matthew James Carlson. Yeah, follow <laughs> us. He's single, guys. Yeah. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> that's uh, true. And uh, so from... 
Ames. Born in Chicago land area, but moved to oh, Ames yeah. when I was real young. So I'm from Ames, uh, which is super boring. And I study journalism and mass communication. Yes, you do. Uh, it's awesome. Matt and I have a class even, together. Oh we do, <laughs> yes. We sit far from each other, but occasionally we make but, eye contact. But yes, we do. And then we're like, <laughs> did he just <laughs> mispronounce did. Malik's name again? <laughs> yes, he did. Malik's. His, his name is Malik. But he, and he always calls him Malik. Malik, Malik. yes. Sad. Yeah. It, um, Why are you studying journalism? Um, so I originally visited Iowa State planning to be a history major and teach. But then I realized that I hate high school students and didn't want to do that. <laughs> so I was like, I have to choose yeah. something else. Why do you hate high school students? Okay, they're just like... Can we unpack this? No, no, no. no. High school students are f- like, meh. But like, you start teaching freshmen and work your way oh, up. Oh, sure. It's like senior, like the... Kind of. Yeah, like the it's old old veterans teach the senior classes. And I didn't want to start with freshmen because right. they're terrible. I almost think that teaching freshmen would be more fun than seniors because seniors are like they have sleeping the and they're all done with class. Oh, that's okay but because that's how I am. And then we'd just be apathetic together. Okay. Um, but yeah, so then I was like, after I visited Iowa State, I knew I had to change my major. And I talked to my grandpa, who still lives in Chicago and does a lot of public relations and writing out there. His grandpas are awesome. Oh, he's the best. Shout he, out to Matt's grandpa hey, if you're watching. Stan, <laughs> what's up? Hey, Stan. And, uh, <laughs> Plug. But yeah, so then I like talked to him at like a holiday, and I was like, oh, I've always liked to write, so maybe I'll do that. And then... I just never hated it, so I kept going. Dude, I actually am a fan of the journalism program. Oh, so Not gonna lie. It's better than Mizzou's. It yes. actually is. Yeah. I love when um when Dr. Dr. B, B like <laughs> bashes Mizzou, and I was like literally wearing my Mizzou sweatshirt when he was like saying that, and I was like. Yeah. What do you? Yeah, because you've done both. <laughs> well, right? I didn't go. I didn't. I did online school when I was there. Oh, uh, okay. And you studied in Ireland. Yeah, yes. I did. So I'm actually looking into grad school in Ireland. Oh, do it. In and Galway. This guy's actually going there next semester. Wait, Wait you like said starting abroad? in December? Yeah. What part? Nice. In Limerick. I loved nice. Limerick. Dude, oh I my gosh, we should too. visit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I have no money or transportation <laughs> oh, to get there, but I'm trying. I love Ireland so much. I'm so excited to go. I'm so That's excited awesome. for you. It was, it's wow. gnarly over there. Okay. So this is one of my favorite questions to ask people. Now, I need you both to come up with, like, one or two things. And if you have, since you guys are roommates, if you guys have things about the other person just to help them out, go for it. We're basically the But same I person, want to so. know things that you nerd out about that, like, you would not, like, <laughs> Annie and I wouldn't know about you unless we literally, like, knew you. And, and so I just want to know. Which, hold on. Andrew, are you a Taylor Swift fan? Okay, because I'm the biggest Taylor Swift fan. Really? Like, yeah. I'm a diehard What's Taylor Swift What's your favorite fan. album? Oh, my gosh. That's a hard question. I love them all for different reasons. Honestly, 1989. Solid. Red. Oh, my gosh. I, I genuinely adore Reputation. Yeah. I'm not going to lie. What? Uh, like, speak, like, I, 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 I cannot. I like them all. I literally do. They're I just, so I really do. I The fact that I couldn't go the Reputation tour, like, actually broke me, but. So that's kind of I. For, I don't know why I know that. That yeah. Andrew likes Taylor Interesting. Swift. Yes, but I know that that would be kind of along the line. So if you guys know anything, you yeah. Things. Yeah. That I, so I say things about Matt. Oh, we say things about no, each or, other. No, or no, you you don't have about yourselves. But oh, if you okay. need a help, yeah. like the other person, little, for it. Okay, let's do let's do one for each of us, and then we'll do one for the other person. Perfect. Too. This is good. Getting thrown on the spot. You start. Um. Okay. I. <laughs> I super nerd out about like the Marvel Cinematic Universe, which did you hear Stanley? Yes, died I want I oh. wanted to work it in somehow. The fact that I was in the bathroom crying on the third floor actually? of parks. I called Matt. Uh. So, I heard from one of my friends, and he's like, "Oh my gosh!" Like I was three floors three away ago. from Andrew, and he calls me and is like, "Dude, Stanley has." passed away and like I just want to give my condolences <laughs> to his family okay, and friends. I heard this what who is that? Oh my even. god. Okay, he I'm is so like wow. the creator and writer of like most of the Marvel comics. And he is he Have you seen the Marvel like maybe Have you seen any okay, Marvel movie? And, he's Annie in is it. like one of the most like I am only listen to indie music, but it's like a very genuine thing. Like uh. she's probably really in the loop and simultaneously out of the loop. So what? I didn't understand. Okay, he is <laughs> so out of the loop right now. Just, okay, so you, he like makes an appearance in like every movie. He's like 
old guy, white every hair. Marvel movie. Every Marvel yes. movie. Every Marvel movie. Every Marvel movie. Every 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 movie. I don't know if I... Name a Marvel character. <laughs> I don't even know. Um, he's Spider-Man. Stanley. Well, Spider-Man is like kind of a recent Marvel character, isn't he? No, I he's all, well, like, okay. Wasn't he, he DC Comics? No, no, no. He's always See, been Marvel, but get. the thing is he was oh, bought yeah, by yeah, Fox. Yeah, that's true. By, no, by S- Sony. He was bought? What? Not Fox. Oh. I actually, I, okay. Spider-Man. There's an a- a- acquisition. So let's get back to Marvel. Yeah, sorry. No, sorry. So what was your favorite, like... Do you have a favorite Marvel movie? Okay, this I'm is... I'm a big Marvel fan. Ooh, this is really tough. Because recently they've been coming out with fantastic movies. Yes. Starting with Spider-Man Homecoming. Which I have never seen. I'm a it's huge... It's so good. And, I'm a uh, huge Spider-Man fan. Okay, so this is the thing. Tobey Maguire was a good, like... Um, Peter Parker, yes. and then Andrew Garfield was a good Spider-Man, Obviously. but Tom yeah, Holland yes. does both so uh, well. We love which, Tom, which makes it such him. a good movie. Okay, so he's such a cutie. Oh, he is. That's mm, true. That's something I can snack. attest to. Oh, <laughs> Not a Marvel fan, but a Tom Holland. Fan. Yes. So then you get uh, Thor Ragnarok, which was a fantastic movie, oh, yeah. sure. and then Black Panther was a great movie, and then Infinity War. So oh, it was funny. like four. Black Panther. I've seen that. Yes. Infinity War was good. Uh, and it, it was a different kind of good. It was a different kind of good. Oh, but yes. It was a painful good. It was like, hurt so good. Yeah. Uh, but when, okay, but when Spider-Man, I'm not going to say anything, but I cried then too. Oh, Like, I've gosh. cried in two movies Okay, but ever. if someone oh, hasn't really? seen it already, mo- there the should one? be spoilers. Yeah, what's the okay. other one? The oh other my gosh, did you know most of that was improv because Tom Holland is terrible at keeping Yes! Up? Oh my gosh, when I learned that, I was like, what? Okay, the other movie is A Walk to Remember with <gasps> Mandy Moore. <laughs> yes! I <laughs> cried. Did you cry? Yeah, I did. <laughs> so good. I also just, just love like Mandy love Moore. Nicholas story. Sparks classic oh, no. based on a book. If you had two sisters, Your you would have seen would it. Your heart would break in no. the <laughs> I had a mom and yeah. she watched... Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones. <laughs> <laughs> Game of Thrones also a banger. So is that is that your geek thing? Your first Dude. one is Game of Thrones. Yeah, definitely. Actually, so when I was in high school, going into college, they're coming out season six of Game of Thrones, and you know I heard the hype. You know, it was something really cool, I guess. And my brother was watching, one, trying to catch up. He was like two episodes behind. He's like, yeah, you, you know, you could catch up. You have five days. And so I'm like, okay. So I watched all through seasons one through five, and then the beginning of season six in five days, in which was like, five which was like ten days? hours of TV and this was a day. During the summer. Yeah. Oh so. my gosh! Did you do anything else? Which, I mean, no, no I shame like, if you did. I'm I just sorry. woke up, ate cheese, ate cheese. I ate cheese, and then it got even better because then that winter I watched seasons one through six in four days, because I was like, why not? You know, is that even? It. I don't know. That's how like you. 18 and hours. Now, <laughs> and now <laughs> I've been able, I have I was able to watch seasons one through seven in four days, which is like 18 hours of TV a day. So good. And I've read the books in a month, what? which are like 5,000 pages. But it's like their family's thing. Like and they, are, they, okay. are they still writing Game of Thrones? That author is a lazy... George Martin, he, you know he like published a different book. Like in the past six months, that wasn't related to Game of Thrones, and like Did he everyone, really? everyone was like throwing hands, like you've got to be kidding me! Like it's his. You are going I'm to convinced. die before you finish this. I've watched interviews by him where he's just like, I don't know, he's just like not super disciplined. No, he's not. Which is kind of funny because he like I don't know. And he, it'd what probably be discouraging too if everyone's telling you to finish the books when you have two more books to write. Yeah. So. I don't know. It's our family thing. You can't, though. like, force that inspiration either. I don't know. It feels weird. Well, he has already, he already of... have the ending picked out. Yeah. You know? So just filling in the gaps. And he kept... So basically the first three books were pretty much like the TV series, but then the last two books he wrote, he just started adding, like, tons of characters. So he made the universe, like, too big for the focus of his book. And huh. Now he's spending forever trying to think of endings yeah. for all the characters. Mm. Oh, man, what a fun time, though. Oh, yeah. For him. I'm like, sure. Hmm. For him. Everyone like, else yeah. is stressed out. Yeah. I love it. Okay, do you guys have nerdy things about the other person that you've learned yeah. from being roommates? Yes. Tell me. Uh, wow, oh, this boy. is this is tough because you have a lot. But <laughs> you're a nerdy, nerdy, nerdy person. person. Yours is, okay, these are, it's like, this is a combo. <laughs> it's my is, major. So, 
oh shoot, that's another one. I, no, I'm just gonna go with the two. So the one is just music in general, and also Legend of Zelda. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's you're really, like really the nerdy. definition of like nerdy. Like yeah, there I love people, it. Like cool nerd. He's like farther than I am. Me. Yeah, but yeah, no, you're I'm like never cooler. done that. <laughs> well, you have to do it sometimes. Oh, yeah. That's like, funny. Just then I just, just push the grease, like, in between my nose. It's kind of disgusting, actually. <laughs> what? It's like your TMI. Face gets, your face gets, like, oily here. You ever feel that? It's oh, kind of, absolutely. Yeah. I think I'm getting, like, red marks on my nose from my glasses. Is your eyesight yeah. bad? Well, really bad. Let's all switch glasses. Yeah. Let's do a pass around. A rota- it's one of my rotate. Favorite. See, I've always wanted glasses, but oh, I look nice. bad enough. I can't see anything. <laughs> look at that. <laughs> They're also really glasses. scratched up, too. So. All right. Now pass again. Oh, man. Okay. Yeah, see, Holy like, cow. I have such a small face. So, like, my all face glasses. Is <laughs> and I thought I had bad Those face. are mine. You look like a little no, bug. No, I think, I think yours are worse. Dude, I feel like mine are the least. Your glasses yeah. are always, your glasses suck, oh, Andy. Oh, my Let's gosh. Let's see, Andy. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. aren't as bad as his. Wait, so oh, I'm the worst? Ow. Yours were the worst on now. me. Oh, my gosh. Back home. Where they belong. <laughs> oh. I, yeah. Isn't it crazy, though, that, like, these on me, I'm like, oh, I feel so good. Are you serious? <laughs> you do? <laughs> when I wear them? I guess that makes sense <laughs> No, I have a huge headache every time I wear them. They're all for the aesthetic. That's why you wear them every day. Guys, I have a super I good question. I do have glasses. <clears throat> that's true. Wait, okay. Andrew, you have to tell me something dirty oh. about Matt. Oh, yeah, oh, that's right. Matt loves... Pizza. <laughs> I knew it. Is. What? Frozen pizza. <laughs> like you That's love pizza. I've like, like, never ha, ha. in my life seen someone explode with <laughs> joy <laughs> over pizza. I just, I just like one you time earlier pizza. this semester. This is not the only time this happened. I just like see Matt Sorry. walk in with like five frozen pizzas and just stuff them all in the freezer, and then like. Maybe like two weeks later, they're all gone. I like, average three to four frozen pizzas a week. Do you like homemade pizza? I love. Okay, and my mom makes the best she homemade does. pizza. It's what, good. It's have con- you ever had chicken what? Alfredo pizza? Yeah, I have not. Do you like Alfredo yeah. and chicken? And I broccoli? do like That's chicken Alfredo. Something no, made no, broccoli is ew because. Gross. Oh, broccoli's yum. Oh. Yeah, broccoli is. Ma- oh yeah. Broccoli I don't, is I don't yeah. know. I get, uh, Sorry, I that's what else. Matt likes, but Matt really dislikes vegetables. Yeah, so, that's true. Like I nice... unnerd about vegetables. That's really interesting. So recently, I was talking to my friend Carson Gifford. Do you know Carson Gifford? Yeah, love I know the Carson. Kid. Well, he was talking about how much <laughs> I've met he loves enchiladas. Ooh, and like another he, solid. And he was talking pick. about his mom's enchiladas. And then he was like, I feel like enchiladas are so underrated. And now that you said pizza and Carson said enchiladas, now I just want to cook for people. I feel like people's favorite foods are maybe things that their mom has made It's well. like nostalgia. And, well, like, that's the thing is, like, there's definitely a like, memory associated yeah. with homemade pizza Because, like, me, <sighs> cheesy chicken and rice. Lasagna. <laughs> Man, also, My Andrew, mom never cooked. It was, like, carrots and apples. <laughs> what are you, Yummy. a horse? <laughs> <laughs> Those are horses. They really are. I am a horse. I was a horse. Come and get it. You like to see Mama right Canoe. Do it for the vlog. What is that called in Harry Potter when they can turn into animals? Transfiguration. Transfiguration. Mm. Oh, good books. Have you guys both read Harry Potter? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Big nah, time. I've, I've read That's who you said like in your video that times. if you would be one Halloween costume. Yeah. You would be <laughs> Harry. Yeah. Biggest fan. Dude, you would be a good Harry. Videos. We had a Harry Potter Halloween themed, like, birthday i think for my brother why is it halloween themed that didn't make sense (laughs) harry potter birthday (laughs) we should have a halloween themed party sometimes we should have a halloween party no no it's in march but it's halloween i've always wanted to like celebrate holidays like just really really like the holiday season yeah i've always wanted to like celebrate holidays like just really like i want to go caroling in april like christmas year round yeah okay yes i would be all about that but that loses the spectacle no. Like, <laughs> yes. No. But no, it's really just like how much everyone is invested. You know what I mean? That's like true. Like, if I goes send formal camp. invitations to my friends and I'm like, we're having a Halloween party and it's like February 2nd, everyone better be all in. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? Well, it's so like, they might have to. Come on, it's like full send. 43 days of Christmas. <laughs> One might say. One, One might, would say. And it would be a rock climber for sure. Okay, but I Never have this question, guys. This is a good question. I'm really excited for this okay. question. It's a little bit deeper than pizza and Zelda. But not um, possible. <clears throat> no, it might not fit the mood, but I love it. Okay, so when you are old, if okay, if what? you get old, oh, no. 
What do you think children will ask you to tell stories about? Okay. <laughs> I, I, this sounds weird, but I think about this a lot. Um, really? What? First like, off... Think, hold on, wait a second. I'm intrigued why you think about this a lot. Um, I just think about, like, stuff that I ask my grandparents. So, like... Oh, I... Uh, wow. I so, first off... I'm probably not going to make it to 60. Did you hear what I eat? No vegetables and frozen pizza. <laughs> so I'm not lasting that yes. long. But we were all uh, thinking it. But <laughs> if I were to... If I, I was to make it If to I were to make it to an, an average age, I think <laughs> it would be, like, dating. Because that's, like, one Whoa. of my most yeah. interesting, like, because dating is so weird now. And yeah. I don't, like, I hear people all the time say, I hope I'm never single again because it's just so weird. And so, like, I have talked to my grandparents I want to unpack this. several I times about, know. like, okay, so what was it like when you asked out grandma? Like, what yeah. was the culture like? And when, like, when you asked her, like, what was it like? And my grandma was like, well, there weren't that many men and no one traveled. And so you just kind of had the people that lived near you. And so yeah. I was like, yeah. So it's, like, very interesting to Dating talk to next them. Door neighbor. I mean, kind of, <laughs> and like, not like they're not like Haley. super great or anything, like, but I don't. I think that's very interesting to me. And now, like, the culture is like shifting, where social media is so huge now. Like, yeah. I think when I don't know, I also would be fine with like arranged marriages coming back. <laughs> so, I interesting. Just, interesting that's, that's how much interesting I hate dating right like, now. That's how much I hate the dating culture. Would you have any, like, like dating advice or, like, um, weird observations or, um, yeah, anything, yeah. any, like, nugget for our yeah. listeners? Well, you're, you're the actual one. <laughs> I was going to say, do you want dating <laughs> advice from a guy who has advice. minimal dating experience? Yes. Yeah. No. Okay. Yeah, no, I think that's good. I give really great dating advice, actually. Um, I think, uh... Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Like, don't make a huge deal about it. So, like, I don't know when. You're not selling your soul if you go on a date with well, someone. Yeah. People like genuinely. Well, like, oh, no, freshman year, there were definitely a lot of girls who think. Yo, See, that's what girls. I date? feel like from a girl's yep. perspective, it's always a big deal. Really. I can't really say because I'm not in the dating world exactly, but I feel like just based on like when I talk to my friends about it, or really mm. any girl. It's because hype squad is a thing, and hype squads yeah. should not be a thing. We should Wait, not... what? A hype squad? What is hype squad? Hype squad is okay. Like, girls are you like... Tell me, you tell me, you're like, oh my gosh, Emily, I have... I'm like, thinking about asking this person out, and I'm like, yes, no, yes, no. And then the whole time, I'm like, did you ask her how it go? Yeah. And, and I'm like, like, yes, yes, yes. So, like, and from, you s- hype it up. Like, oh, really, yeah. what well, is ben a date? Sweet does a that. day A day is two people... Like Spending hanging out, with each other. Tr- d- just getting to know each other. You're yeah. not selling your soul. You're not committing to anyone. Yeah. You know, everyone needs, wants like, to it know. It needs to be so it? casual. Well, well you think about like the the build up. Like when you're like you tell your friends, "Oh my gosh, I have a crush on so and so." This is how it is for girls. Oh my gosh. Then it's like, oh my gosh. I like, crushes were did you done. talk to her? I think he likes you. Do you ever see that? No crushes. Like, <laughs> Maybe it's just so like sexual friends. Sorry if I'm exposing myself. Yeah, and then the girls are like, "Oh my gosh, I want to know every detail." Well, and they're I always like, it, they'll say the things movie, like, bitch. oh my gosh, I think he likes you. Like, uh, Yeah, they'll be like, like, oh wait, did he like your photo? Or like, not necessarily that, but like, like I think little things. Like, and then your friends are I'm like. Stop, I'm going to stop liking photos. No, here. that's what I'm <laughs> saying. Like, that's Hype not necessarily Squad, Hype Hype Squad is so the worst. So to all of our listeners out there, Hype Squad should be illegal. A fireable offense. Put in jail. Mm, they're not protected in the Constitution. No, not f- no First Amendment rights. In, None. In Hype Squad. have no rights. No, genuinely. High yeah. Squad is the worst. Oh, that's super interesting. Yeah, I don't know, because it's like, also don't put a lot on it. So, like, I feel like in, like, in my younger years, when when <laughs> Matty Ice was just a young lad, <laughs> he, Ice like, <laughs> was like, oh, my gosh, like, if she says no, I'm devastated. Yeah. And then, like, but actually, she might not just like you, and that's mm-hmm. okay. Like, yeah, there's exactly. not a ton that needs to be, like, built into it. So if she says no <sighs> Too much hype. or no to a second date or no to a 40 second date like <laughs> it's just she ain't into you bro. <laughs> bro. 41 was my cut off. Yeah. I, can't. I buy her like 41 coffees and then she's like I'm out. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm actually, actually for a reason. reason it was very specific for a reason. 
No, I'm just for kidding. Very <laughs> for reason. Yes. Okay, Andrew, do you have um, an answer to our question? When you're old, what do you think your ki- children will ask you to tell stories about? Some, like, crazy things I did that were just, like, oh my completely, gosh, like, yes. why did you do that? Or do you do like, a lot of, like, dumb pump? things? Not, like, specifically dumb, but just, like, thing, things that just full send, you know? Like, are you confidently awkward? Yeah. Praise Jesus. So, <laughs> I just want to, like, kids will not know me. Like, my grandparents will not know me, or grandkids will not know me. And then they'll start, like, asking, like, simple questions as they grow up and, like, They'd be like, what the heck? Like, <laughs> I feel like that's man? like totally a thing though, is like realizing your grandparents are we're real humans. We're real people. Your and they're parents like, too. Yeah. Oh, like, oh my like, gosh, my no, mom Kathy, was literally you're doing 14. Some crazy stuff. Yes. I yeah, I think my, Granted, mom, my they parents did seem not, like they're the same age as me. They though. did not grow up in the same time as us. There are a lot of things that are different. Like my mom was was holding me. Like, when she was 21, she literally had birthed me already. Second kid. Was like, I? she was married at 17. So we didn't, we have not lived the same life. But, like, she's been 21 before. She just hasn't been 21 in, like, single and in college before. Yeah. She's been 21 and a mom. But you Your know what I mean? Your mom so was 17? My mom yeah. had me when she was 39. <laughs> my mom difference. is 42. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> My mom's like 60 now. <laughs> <laughs> Your mom could probably be my mom's mom. She could. Oh, she could. But Janet is the best. No, I believe oh, yeah. it. She kind of is. Yeah. But I, I mean, that's it. the thing. She's like, my grandparents mom. are really old because they had my parents when they were old. Yeah. But my parents uh. aren't that old. Okay, what, this is a question that was at the coffee table today. What's your perfect marriage age? Hmm. <laughs> What's the coffee table? What? It Ew. was like me, Harrison Getzko, Bree, Snyder. Oh, like literally you were at a coffee shop. marriage age? Like, what? Yeah. Is this like, mm, this is tough. Because I, I also range? don't know when I'm like meeting the person. <laughs> but like, like if age? this is Emma Watson, it's right now. <laughs> Emma Watson. I, from what like, a dime. Honestly, all about this, I'd say like, I couldn't give an age, but like the range would have to definitely be in the 20s. It's like, somewhere between like 20 and 80. By the time I reach my 30s, I'll become too cynical for marriage. Yes. So, <laughs> Whoa! Slash no, dead. I'll, I'll, I'll probably, I'm like, <laughs> I have the cheese. train of thought that, man, if I reach my 30s and I'm single, I'll probably just start hating the idea and then become super cynical and be like... It's such a Midwest that? thing, because they're like, West Coast, people aren't even thinking about marriage. Right. Like, yeah. in LA, they're like, it's crazy. married by 30? Whoa, slow down. Like, yeah, like you, you're still young. Yeah, literal it's wild. baby. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. It's kind of interesting. Well, it's also interesting, too, because, like, I personally, when I was really young, I was like, I'm going to have a boyfriend in high school. And then in high school, I just, <laughs> just never thought about it. And then I was like, I'll start dating in college. And, like, it didn't happen yet. And when I'm 30... <laughs> self-promoting. <laughs> but, like, when I'm 30, I feel like I'll just be like, Did you oh. just sell five? Because I do that all the time. Yeah, I think I just clap my hands. Oh, okay. Is that a sin? I don't do that. I mean... I don't clap my hands. I only sell five. Go, Annie. I, I always just say, good one, Matt, and then, <laughs> yes. like... Okay. So yeah, I was self five, But... So, anyway. Anyway, but then when you're 30, am I going to be, like... Like, right now, I'm like, I have to, like, be dating and married by 30. But when, when I'm 30, if it hasn't happened, I feel like I'll be like, oh, Okay. You Whoops. Know? Yeah, like, oh, I guess, <laughs> guess 40 is the new goal, and then I'll be 40. All right. <laughs> I, <laughs> I, I, I was saying, like, on this. If, and like, now I'm going to go cry. Oh, um. But also, like, if I, if we get to be 50, and I really plan on being, backup. like, unmarried and living above Andrew's garage. Like, this, his, yeah, like, his, I, like his family will be there. For this. Yes, and, and I his, love it. Like, his family will be there, and then they'll be like, Mom, I think I saw an old man in my room. And they're like, no, that's okay. It was just a dream. But actually, it was like old man Matt. Like, yeah, oh, like, I just wanted to go downstairs see, and get some okay chocolate milk. And, like, I love yeah. how you're going to age like way faster. <laughs> yeah. and an old man. I don't that's kids. what happens when you eat like, pizza. Yeah, that's at the age of like 24, by the way. That's not like when, <laughs> when we're When you real eat old. pizza, you age. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait. So, this is a fun question. I love this question. Oh, but say you're not married until you're, like, 35. I think every one of us should answer this. Do you have a person that's like, okay, if we're not married by 40, we'll just get married. Do you have that person? I'm trying to think. But. No. You don't? No, I mean. Don't lie. Everyone <laughs> does. Everyone's got that one high school friend yeah. where, like, 
Back up. Okay, yeah. Back up. I kind of do. Who is it? I can't say. No, you have to. What? I will well, say, okay. honestly, Maybe I don't to say, don't we? We mean nothing. No, that's he a lot. Nothing. Okay. He has a girlfriend. He probably shouldn't answer okay, this. Yeah. He has You're a out. Well, what if it's kind of like one-sided? <laughs> like, well, I'm planning. That's, that's fine. <laughs> no, that's fine. That's totally fine. Yeah. I Keep still it. feel like I should not No, you say have it. to say it. Well, okay, well, there's... Disclose okay, information. First of all... This is important information. Yeah, I can't tell everyone. What if that potential then, person sees this? Yeah. And then they're, like, freaked out. Exactly. That's okay. We don't have that many subscribers. I don't know yeah, about you guys. We, yeah, we, we do. We're we pretty do. famous. Emily and Andy are blowing up the internet. <laughs> yeah, sorry. We Matt almost got 30 Andy views on our last video, so back because off. Because we can't figure out how to use the podcast app. <laughs> this is on YouTube. <laughs> well, so okay. Now, do you have the person? Okay, well, first of all, there is a boy in high school that we were like, yeah, maybe we'll get married when we're 30 or 40 when neither of us are married. He's not, he's gone off way different direction slash has a girlfriend. So now I'm kind of like, I don't know. Just because there's, there's a goal in you know, so there's as always as someone in the back of my score. head, but I, I'm not going to say. Okay, that's fair. <laughs> what? Just because Sakura has a goalie doesn't mean you can't strike out. <laughs> We're playing baseball now? Uh, I heard that on the bus in <laughs> Ireland. And, yeah, I thought it was wild. Do you have a good Irish accent? Uh, it's not great, but it's gotten better. Do you mean like something like turn left at the Aldi? Uh, they say that all the time. Okay, well, the thing is, you have like a phrase that <laughs> gets so you into it. So right, you, like, so your so phrase so. is tree turty on a Thursday. So what, what am I saying tree. again? T- 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 turn left at the Aldi. <laughs> turn left at the Aldi and, uh, and just turn keep going left. down there, turn right and. Uh, it's pretty good. Uh, it's, yeah, it's not, it's not bad. My, 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 my Londoner accent's way Did better. Did you like but... actually develop that as your normal speech when you're there? No, but one of the interesting things is like the way they say their alphabet did rub off. So it's A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T V W X Y and Z. And so, <laughs> Z. so, so it's like so it's H and Z, and other than that, it's the same. But like, so when I spell my name, I was like. Oh, you can email me at M A T T H E W. And then, like, I got back and Nick Day was like, Hey, T W. Frick. And I was like, Hey, T W. Yeah. I wouldn't so. even have any fun with that because I don't have any of those letters H- in my name. Z. Z. I yeah. think Z's funny. They're Zed. like, We're just really into EDM music. So we named our final letter of the alphabet after one of the greatest EDM artists of all time. Uh, I don't get that reference. I don't know. You don't know Z. Z. More like Z Leplin. Z. Okay. Wait, Andy, did you answer the question? What question? No, she didn't. But yes, I did. I said oh, I'm not going to say. Okay. And, well, who's your You're person? Yours. Emily? Yeah. Oh, okay. So, like, if I'm 40, I've actually never really thought about this. So, I just think of my, like, guy friends that I really, really love. So, I'm the only person but who has, like, a person in mind. No, no, no. I have a person no, 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 no. in mind, but I'm not going to I think that, like, like, I have this friend. One of my best friends, his name is Mike, but I don't think he would be the person. I feel like we'd just be, like... We that's probably a, just become roommates. I don't think we get married. That's a great that's, husband name. That's, but Mike. maybe my friend Jared. I don't know. He weird, went like to Jared. Weird. He went to Jared. He's like, I hate Jared. And they, they were, were roommates. roommates. <laughs> 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 they were roommates. You guys are roommates. <laughs> We've can lived together a, for too long. Can this become long. a Vine culture podcast? Comment down below if you want this to become a Vine culture pop podcast. It's super good. Uh, okay, oh, wait, Matt, who's I yours? I could have my, my croissant. Frey Shibaka do. Frey Okay. Anyway. Uh, who's yours, Matt? I hope I'm someone's. Um, so I me too. Two, I hope the person it's really sad I... if I don't have, like, have I have two? someone, but, yeah. <laughs> uh, so mine is also a high school friend. Uh yeah, her name is Destiny. You know Destiny. Oh, Destiny. Yes, yes, I love Destiny. She's a cool cat. Destiny is your destiny. Um, <laughs> Annie, sure, I like yeah. wonder where you are in the game. But day. like, I don't know. I'm already kind <laughs> of like. No, am I in the shot? No, you're perfect, I'm sure. I'm <laughs> you're, in the shot. You just get back. I, better better be. I mean, you my better be weird. Like, while. it's straight on me right now, honestly. It's like me and Matt. I'm, I'm just, just <laughs> really questioning if I've been in the shot the whole time. Oh, I can't see. I hope it's even perfect. <laughs> it's okay. Anyway. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm like, I don't know. I like play slow pitch softball with her dad in the summer. So I'm already kind of in their family. That's, That's true. Yeah. Is her brother still dancing in New York? Not in New York, but right. he's in Indiana. Oh. Yeah, he was at the Joffrey Ballet. Yeah, Joffrey. Um, Joffrey Hall. Yeah. Oh, Ohio State <laughs> Residence Hall dancer. Yeah, he just dances through the halls. <laughs> like, oh, that's what that kid is. I remember. I was wondering. Matt, how did we meet? It was in high school. It was at some point in high school. Oh. <laughs> but I, I don't remember our first meeting. No, and that's the thing is I never remember the first time that I meet people. 
But like I remember, <laughs> I, see, so I, I remember that I know them, but I don't when like. When did you meet me? Okay, well that's easy. The first time we moved in, but like I Were don't. Were you guys re- freshman that? year roommates? Yes. Wow. Yeah, so freshman sophomore page. junior. I can tell you the whole yeah, two two five five. Oh my gosh, Riley Hall. that's like amazing. We're almost common law married. We've lived together for so long. We're all, like, halfway there. If you get to... Oh, I thought it was, like, five years for some reason. What? I thought it was seven. If it's five, we're even closer. But, yeah. So. Are you living together next year? We are. Is it a buzz topic? I was like, I don't want to step on any toes. No, yeah, we... We re-signed, right? Yeah. I don't, <laughs> yes, we re-signed. Same place? <laughs> Same place, oh, yeah. yeah. It's amazing. I like your guys' apartment. It's a good time. I know where you live. I don't... Okay, we have a... We have a, um... Would you rather, and then you guys have a would you rather, too? Yes, we do. Yes. Okay, oh, yeah. so we'll do two of them. Okay. okay. So, Fire this away. would you rather is from the Harrison Getsko, who is the podcast at our on our first. Yes, yes. Yeah, yes. First, um, okay. How many of our podcasts have you listened to? I've listened to all of them. Have you really? <laughs> yes, I have. Oh, my God. Andrew has I'm it, probably. I'm <laughs> so humbled. This no, makes yeah. me so happy. Wow, we are so proud. Wow. You probably learned a lot of weird things about yeah. us. You yeah. Know, like, he's probably especially me, because I just blabbed the whole yeah, time. Yeah, like, Annie's weird and cryptic. No, we love <laughs> Annie. About okay, ready? <clears throat> and I want everyone to answer this. All four of us. Okay. Oh. Full send. Would you rather have the ability to pl- fly for one year at any speed, or... Have the ability to fly for a lifetime, but only at maximum speed of 25 miles an hour. Lifetime. Oh. 100%. This is so tough. Why? Does this mean my person can fly? Like me? Yes. Like you can fly. Body? Yeah. My lifetime? For when would I ever need to go more than 25 miles per hour? Rarely. If I can already fly, I'm already just like a step up from everyone else. I don't Plus, need to show you're cutting off. out a lot of traffic. Yeah, and so like, like the fact that you're not like, like flying as can, the crow does. I can still, I, I can still drive. I can still take an airplane if I need to, but like also if I'm late to class and I just want to fly, if I can fly 25 mile, miles an hour to class, I think it's cold up I there. I think though. my thing mm. would be: Am oh, I the goodness. only person that gets this? Because if most of my friends chose the 25 miles per hour to fly, you I would, would have extreme too. FOMO that they were flying for a lifetime and I only and chose to fly for a year. Oh, but if it was just a me thing, I think I would choose the any speed so that for a year I could just fly everywhere and I would just like travel the world and then I would just be a yeah. normal person because if everyone's normal, then I'm not really missing out. I just mm-hmm. had that year of really fun adventure. Can I fly into space? Is that a thing? Oh yeah. yeah. We talked about the, space in our uh, last episode. I can get to the moon in three days if if that's possible. So I would but really if you can fly love at any that. Speed. Okay, are we saying oh, you're this is like the silver surfer light. though? Oh man. I don't want to go faster than light. That would be a nightmare. That I would think. mess I would, up your hair. I want to break the yeah. speed of sound. My hair. This is really tough, but I think I'm. Oh, this is real tough, but I think I'm gonna go <coughs> lifetime. Nice. Thank you. Uh, that's Andrew, so tough though. Support. That's a tough I would one. definitely go with the year. See, yeah. like, I'd want to know in so advance we're two for when two. this. I'd want to know in advance when this year starts, so I could plan out like yes, things like, I want to do. Take, take a, a gap. Yes. Yeah. Okay. And, that's like, yeah. Make sure I make this the most eventful year to yeah. go and do something crazy like that, and then, like, I don't. I wouldn't feel the need to like keep doing it forever and ever. Like, if it was twenty five miles an hour, sure you like cut some convenience on things. But yeah. if you get if you get one good year to go fly everywhere, like. You hit everything you want. And that's yeah. basically the superpower of teleportation. Yeah, that's why I'm it. saying if you go, yeah, if you go as fast as you want, mm-hmm. can you basically can you just... But you get the wind. Does the wind affect your speed? But, no, but you get to feel the wind in your face. Yeah. In a good way or in like yeah. a, this is painful and I feel like my skin yeah, is... Yeah, like, like when you're moving off. really fast and you start crying. Yeah. I cry when, when I I'm walked tired in class. Or ski today. Oh. Yeah, ski goggles. Oakley's, man. Mm. <laughs> That's um, do you guys know your Enneagram numbers? Uh, uh, we, we, we did at one point. I'm the achiever. Um, That's all. The three. Yeah. Oh, nice. Are you? It's three say. and six. It was my second The one. loyalist. Yeah. Aww. <laughs> I was the one that everyone is. What is that? Four or seven? Two. Seven. You're two. I feel like I know a lot of twos. Okay, so let me just give you a brief. One is the, like, perfectionist kind of. Two is, like, the helper. Three is the achiever. Four is the individualist. That's me. 
Um, five is the, oh shoot, what are they called? They, I forget their word, but they're really like depth and they like um, figuring things out. The investigator. Yes. Six is the loyalist, seven is the enthusiast, eight is the seven. challenger, and nine is the peacemaker. Yeah, I'm the seven. Yeah. You're the, wait, what's that? The enthusiast. Enthusiast. Mm. See, that's what I thought I'd be. No, I'm a four to the core. Yeah, you I'm are. a seven <laughs> to the head out of 11. <laughs> that's way too high. <laughs> Anyway, um, you guys is you guys oh. have a yes. Okay, this is this is one of my like this is my current favorite. Would you rather? And I've I like to play devil's advocate, but and I want everyone to answer as well. Would you rather only be able to open doors or only be able to close doors? So lock, literally or. Like, no, yeah, literally. So, like, if this door is closed, you could either open it, but then not be able to close it, or if it was open, you could close it, but not open it. So, like, you would be in a lot of rooms that the doors are open. You'd Yeah, and you would have no ability to close any kind of door. So, like, you'd so drive you walk into your house, your... or no, you'd drive with your car door open? Yeah, you would either have to drive with it open... Or not drive. Or get someone to open it for you, and then you could close it. But then you wouldn't be able to get out. This is why I love this question. But also, this I just feel like this is never going to happen. <laughs> so I can't what? think too seriously about this. We're going to talking... go flying and whatever. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> <we're talking about. laughs> I, would be, I feel like I'm more likely to fly than... <laughs> than lose the ability. Okay, I actually think... This might be, like, like oddly question, deep. Though. Yes. But and I think it says a lot about your no. person. Like your favorite bridge. Now, I would for sure... Favorite bridge? Yeah. That tells a lot Hold about a person. Sh- that's good... Oh, buddy. What? We could talk for hours. Okay. So oh, I would I for mean. sure be able to open doors. You would want to open them. Because I need to be able to escape and run as often as I need to. Yeah. Right? Hold on, wait, are you going to play devil's advocate? Yes, I am. Okay, please ask me. Okay, but what if, you know, someone's chasing you, you're going home, you run in your house, but then you can't shut the door, and they're still running what if at they're you. But I'm, you I'm faster, door. and I can still get away. Yeah. You think? I'm yes. with you. But then you're never safe you're behind a closed faster, door. Then or you're not faster, get murdered anymore. But, like, <laughs> if you're behind closed doors all the time, then you're just, like, trapped in this stagnant life, I waiting th- for other people. I think it's more of the fear of... Like, for the being one. dependent on someone <laughs> else to open my doors. So you know then, what I mean? Because, like, yeah. you can't close doors. Or, like, right now when it's getting cold out and none of your roommates are home, like, you can open the door to go inside, <laughs> but then you can't close it to shut out all can the you, cold air. Can you? But I could but call my uh, neighbor. <laughs> no, okay. you can't. I could call my neighbor. You could call a neighbor, can yeah. Can you please shut my door? <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah. Really can you lives right up the stairs. Yeah. That's true. Right. What a dream. I don't know. I think it's. I think I I'm value open. Okay, more. Okay, so you would rather open I'm doors. Open. I can't. I can't even fathom this the comfort one. and safety. Comfort and safety are not as tra- attractive to me as being able to run. Also, Retweet. but like, think about this. You would That's always. That's a poem in itself. You would either have to drive with someone all the time so they could close the door, or drive with the door. I just picture myself kind of curbing it and like hitting the stop sign and letting and that like, like yeah, no, yeah, yeah, I'm 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 driving. Driving. the I'm one door is gonna be dented as yeah, heck. Yeah, but like, but <laughs> who cares? Worth it? Drive a jeep. Yes. So right now, no doors. I ripped my door handles off my car. On purpose? Oh, accident! No, one hundred percent accident. Like so now I have to roll my window down, open my door, keep my car on, roll it up. And then, like, get out. So I feel like I'm kind of in a weird, Oh, like, my gosh, you're kind of in a weird... Right now, I, like, actually I'm, am kind of locked in. Interesting. I, don't, I think it's kind of a safety thing. Like, might not that be... That okay. super is, but I'm not here to judge because yeah. uh, up until, oh, gosh, this last year, I drove a car that needed a screwdriver uh, for not one, but two of its main operations. <laughs> so oh I love gosh. that. Yeah. That's, That's so funny. I miss that car. uh uh-huh. Okay, so now since we are wait, okay, so would wait. you? What would you? You said you would rather open doors oh, yeah. too. Okay, is it because? <laughs> yeah, why? I think, I think for me it was the fact that I just don't want like opportunities. Yeah. Okay, in the in the literal sense, not have opportunities closed. If you can't open doors, like, what can you? How do you do? get to class? How do you yeah, do it? Exactly. You literally yeah. have to follow someone around. Like yeah. I could probably live with like. 
All right, I guess just I'm leaving the door room. to my room open so everyone's, someone could watch me sleep, I guess. Whatever. I, I love watching people sleep. Uh, no, maybe we should cut that out. It's oh like my one gosh, of my favorite things. I'm keeping that <laughs> <laughs> I'm also being in. Sorry, you're not being But, there. like, I, I, it'd be more manageable to live without being able to close doors, I think. Yeah. That's you could make a I way don't know. around. It's, there's something, that, okay, but me being such a... Me, an intellect. I'm kidding. Um, like, thinking about this, there's something really fascinating about the fact that we don't like to be, like, Closed contained. In. Well, that's what I feel. Or, like, like mm, almost like a... I'm an individual. <laughs> <laughs> I'm more just, like, <laughs> impatient. Like, the fact that if I wanted to leave and have to wait for someone... Yeah, and then you Scott, always allow other people to come and join. It's like they're controlling your life. Yeah, like, door open door policy for real. Literally. Don't yes. own anything important, then. Come on in. My door is literally open because I can't close it. Because I can't close it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and when you leave, can you please shut the you door? Guys should try, <laughs> you, guys should, have, you guys should go a day trying to, like, choosing one. Oh, this would be so <gasps> that difficult. That would be like, vlo- And, like, really? vlog it? Yes. Oh. We could all like, vlog our you're day. You're standing outside of ethics video. and you have to, like, wait I'm just for like, someone Emily, to, like, let me in, yeah. please. <laughs> like, you should do it. That would be yes. so oh, interesting. That would be kind of fun. Like, get driving. Hard. Dude, oh that YouTube God. video would go viral. You'd I think I, do, I could do that, like, next week while I'm home and try to, like, yeah. drive on it. Okay, then you could just, like, sit on the couch and Wait, no, 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 because I'm saying, like, if I wanted to drive anywhere. Uh, I see what you're saying. I don't know. I also want to give a shout-out to uh, one of my podcasts, my favorite ones, uh, Culture Kings. That's where I, like, actually got this. Yeah, I listened to it. Do you really? Yeah, well, you sent it to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's uh, really good, and so, like, they, they had that question up on there, and I was like, that's super interesting. So I started asking everyone. And most people say they want to be able to open doors. Yeah. Well, it makes sense. Yeah. But do you think, it's like a, do you think it's like it makes a difference if you're an introvert or an extrovert? Or Probably. Or like, like a little. You, or just your personality type in general. In general. Yeah. I think it might. Yeah. Um, huh. Also, uh, I have connection group in 15 minutes. Okay, so we need to get uh, to our so full same stories. What yeah, time is yeah. it? Yeah. It's I think like I have to 6.45. <laughs> I have to go shoot a no. um, jazz concert. Oh, yeah. <laughs>um, my full scent, oh, should I do an Ireland story or a Curtis Beercher story? Curtis Beercher for sure. Boom, Curtis Beercher. Okay, so last year we were, I, can't, I think we were hanging out in Farley because we were hanging out with like Mitch and Kyle. Yeah. And so it's Andrew, myself, and then two of our buddies, Mitchell and Kyle. And we're like, it's December 2nd. And we're perfect like, day we're going to do Curtis to Beecher. It is a perfect day because no one's like, out. And that was the thing is like, if it's when snowing, I've though, done that's it, like really bright outside. See, that was the thing is like, there was no snow. It was really cold, but like, th- huh. it was perfect <laughs> so there was no one out there because no one else numb. is that stupid. Yeah. So, uh, I would say that was definitely a full send. Did you make it? Oh, yeah. We, I think we all yeah, made it. we all made it. Do you want to explain to the moms of the podcast? Yeah, what? hashtag our moms. We have, like, six moms. <laughs> Mom gets, hey, hey, moms. moms. Maybe, uh, maybe moms. they don't even know what Curtis of So, is. Curtis of is an Iowa State tradition, yeah, tradition in which students sure, makes it better. begin <laughs> on <laughs> the tradition. atop steps of Curtis Hall. Academics, man. We're and all about the academics. <laughs> Campus. <laughs> Right after a late night of studying at the library. For some reason, I always picture it beer cheer to Curtis, not Curtis to beer cheer. Oh, yeah. I don't know why. If you do that, you, like, you have to. <laughs> you, like, yeah, yeah, then you got to do it. Yeah. 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 Then you look <laughs> like a <laughs> dingus. Yeah, if you do that, you can't graduate. Yeah. Like, they know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, but some students uh, do remove <laughs> items of clothing. Strip. And <laughs> they just naked. And uh, run Beep. from <laughs> Beep run from the Can't top of the steps of Curtis uh, and to the top steps of Beersher Hall in the time. Fit for life. It's exercise. It's super yes. exercise. <laughs> it's super uh, exercise. In the time that the Campanile does its 12, no pun intended, but 12 dongs. And so they'll like <laughs> ring out. And yeah. Da, 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 da. Yeah. 
Oh, it's a great tune. Uh, yeah. Did you make it? Yeah. Well, oh yeah, we made it. Uh, I don't want to brag, but I did cross country in high school. So, like, <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yes. So, oh, do you have any send advice? Voice it. If it's not audible, then what are you doing? Like every time, like I'll cross the street and I'm like, I'm gonna send it, and then I like go across the crosswalk. You must so, like, send it. So it's yeah. like. If the people around you, strangers or friends, don't know about it, then, like, what are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> then why <laughs> are you care. sending it? Why are you, like, secretly Ooh. sending it? So, like, uh, you can't be like, oh, we're just gonna... You yeah. gotta be like, I'm gonna do it! And then and then everyone around you knows, like, all right, this is something that we gotta watch. I love it. Yeah. Yeah. So. Okay, Andrew, do you have a full sign story? Yeah, I do. Was... So, back in about late April, I was like... Are you gonna say the late 80s? Oh, yeah. Back in, uh, back in late April, I was like, frick it, I'm going to run a marathon. So then I started training the next day, and then I ran the marathon. Just <laughs> recently? Like, also in late April. April. No. <laughs> How uh, yeah. was it? It was so good. It was so much fun. Did, did you, you like it? I loved it. Why? I ran the whole time. Did you run? Why did I like it? Yeah. Because it was so I exhilarating. See. I don't know. It's, I, so, I love yeah. adrenaline rushes, so mm-hmm. like... Anything will just be crazy, like the Buffalo Wild Wings, like, blazing challenge, stuff that like that. That was fun. Yeah. Like, you just got to do something that just, like, gets your blood going, yeah. you know? That's I so interesting. Quite literally, it got my blood going. Yes. <laughs> like, a lot. What's but, your... So, how'd you, like, run previously? Um, I ran cross country in high school, but I basically <laughs> stopped <laughs> running too. senior year because I was hated running so much, and then I didn't run until the end of sophomore year. Which yeah. was when you started training. Yeah. Right? Well, I mean, we ran like Did a couple times. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it was like, so don't we all? It wasn't, it so wasn't a time, but I wanted to count like, it. We're cross country. It was basically yeah. just to keep those frozen pizzas off. Like, yeah, pretty much. Yeah. I was like, I kind of look fat now. I need to like do something. So, did you legitimately train? Mm-hmm. Like, did you start from? Like, you yeah. ran like yeah. 60 miles every now and again? Yeah. 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 I, I, there were like several times. The largest where, like, I did was 22 before the marathon. I, I want to do an Ironman. That's like on that's my That's also what I want to do. That's actually another full sign experience. I, I did a t- triathlon, <laughs> and I was a big fan, so I'm like, I should do an Ironman. It's like, I don't know what it's about. It's just like crazy enough. You have to be crazy enough to really want to do it. But yourself. like, when I finished, I went across that finish line, and I'm like, holy crap. Like, I did this. What yeah. was your time? It was about well, three hours and 33 minutes. So what was wow. your split? It was about eight minute split. That's awesome. Impressive. That's really great. Yeah, it was so fun. And honestly, like, <laughs> for full send advice, you, when you want to do something, like Matt said, you got to make it known. Like, I basically was, like, telling my roommates, Matt and Nick at the time, like, yeah, I'm going to run a marathon. They're like, ha-ha, funny. <laughs> okay, he's yeah. so flaky. So he'll back <laughs> out of things, and he did it, and I was really impressed. When I really want to do something, I do it. You got to you gotta know you want to like do it. Like computer engineering or yeah. computer yeah. science. It's like, do it, you know? Why not? It sounds just like Becca. You just kind of do it, you know? Yeah. What are you, silly? I'm still yeah. going to send it. Oh, that's, yes! That's the video you, that I showed you. You have to spend enough time well. to, like, decide this is a it. commitment I want to, like, uphold. And this yeah. is something yeah. I want to follow. Well, that's the thing but... about saying it out loud, too, is, like, people to hold you accountable. Mm-hmm. You're like, mm. I'm going to run a marathon. You make it real. Like, but then you, like, mm. don't run a marathon. Once you actually, like, decide I want to do this, like... Make sure people know, because otherwise you, you might then, become flaky about it. Right, because and then if people know, you're like, I, I have to do it now. Mm-hmm. Huh. Because yeah. if not, I look like. Would I rather look like a lame-o? Or would I rather? Or would you rather it? die running a marathon? Also, if risky. you really want to do it that much, put it on your bucket list, because then you think like, I want to do this before I die. You yeah. Know? Mm. And I'm in my twenties, which are supposedly your best physical years. So why not now? When's your birthday? Are you in August birthday? July 23rd. Oh, so it's close. Raise your July 29th. Close 20. to Harry Potter's birthday. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, Are you guys yeah. all in your 20s? Daniel Radcliffe actually yeah. has the same birthday as me. <gasps> Harry. That's oh, amazing. Yeah. That's that? amazing. Wow, that guys. Nice. Thanks for being on the hour-long podcast. Oh, my God. I know. <laughs> How it was long did we talk? I don't know. It was know. super long. What that mean? number is so high, and I don't know what it means. But it's never <laughs> been that high uh, <laughs> Yeah, it's kind of scary, but thanks for having us. <laughs> yeah, and thanks for time. being on our show. Yeah, like, we just killed two or just one stone. Yeah, we kind of did, so. Uh, How yeah, we? where can people find you guys? So, like, we YouTube. Are still filming? Yeah. <laughs> Are you Hopefully. Sure? Hopefully. <laughs> if it's not. 
Right. <laughs> well, we got it on audio. That's true, we, yeah. You can find our podcast uh, via my YouTube channel. It's called Authentically Annie. Or you can go to my... <laughs> two L's, two N's, probably. Yep, exactly. Wow. And Spelling. if you can't find it, go to my Instagram, which is Annie Cassett, two N's, two S's, and two T's. And <laughs> wow, that's bio. so extra. <laughs> yep. I two just... N's, two S's, and two T's. <laughs> You Emily can... Knittle, Angel, not Angle, E L. K N I T T E L. Everyone's like Ellie. Okay. Oh. <laughs> you that was like such a visual realization. Yeah, <laughs> like visual we were all kind of lost, but oh, now it makes sense. Sorry, we're back. Okay, actually, we're leaving. But I have to photograph. A... It's six. Yeah, we all have to do stuff. So. Okay. Right. Wait, we're... how do wait, how do we sing it again? Um, do do? what song do we sing? eBay. Happy birthday to <laughs> no. you. Happy no. birthday. Are we doing the same one though? No, no. What is it? I da, want da, da, I a full a full yeah. Okay. Tell ready. me why. I'm not. <laughs> okay. Ready. <clears throat> Five, Mash six, pitch. seven. Uh, I, I wanna. Want <laughs> no. Uh, no. Guys, guys, guys. Come on. This is real tough. You're in uh, choir, aren't you? Uh, yeah. Me too. Uh, uh, can you sing? Uh, yeah. Why don't you sing it yourself? Noise. Let's harmonize. That was good. Let's harmonize. Try it. Ready? Mm-hmm. I want a full send. Yeah. I sing really high. She sings high. All right. Yeah. All right. Thanks for. Oh, yeah, I need to. <laughs>